Hello, dear students. This is the other topic of revision. What are we going to revise today? We are going to revise the present simple tense. When to use present simple? How it is formed? Which are the verbs that take ES in the third person singular? And some spelling rules about this. We use the present simple for habits or daily routines, such as He gets up at 7 o'clock. Here we have a daily routine. She walks to school. It is a habit of her. The second use for permanent states. For example, they live in France. We live in Albania. How is the present simple form? In the affirmative, we use the subject plus the verb and the object. For example, I work in a bank. The negative form is subject plus the auxiliary verb don't or doesn't plus verb plus object. Here we have the example she doesn't speak English. And the interrogative form it is auxiliary verb do or does for the third person singular plus subject plus verb and plus object. The example I chose is do you play the piano? How to conjugate verbs in present simple? In the affirmative, we see that the third person singular, the verb takes S. He, she, it works. In the negative, we add the auxiliary don't and doesn't for the third person singular pronouns. He, she, it. I don't work. You don't work. He, she, it doesn't work. We don't work. You don't work. And they don't work. How to form the interrogative form? We put the auxiliary, the subject and the verb. Here again, pay much attention to the third person singular because the auxiliary here is does. Do I work? Do you work? Does he, she, it work? Do we work? Do you work? And they, do they work? The short answers. How do we form them? We form them by yes or no, plus the subject, and then we add the auxiliary verb again. Mind that we do not use the whole sentence when we answer. We do not use the verb either after the auxiliary. For example, do they live in Albania? The positive answer would be yes, they do. And the negative one would be no, they don't. Now let's see some spelling rules about the third person singular. In present simple, most verbs take S in the third person singular. For example, I sit, he sits. I walk, he walks. Verbs ending in SS, SH, CH, X and O take ES in the third person singular. For example, I miss, he misses. I push, he pushes. I catch, he catches. I fix, he fixes. I go, he goes. The other case, verbs that end in consonant plus Y, drop the Y and take I, E, S. For example, I try, he tries. I cry, he cries. I fly, he flies. 
verbs ending in vowel plus y take just s, as most verbs do. Be very attentive here. I play, he plays. I stay, he stays. Let's see now which are some time expressions that are mostly used with the present simple. Every day, every year, every month, always, once a week, seldom, usually, sometimes, and on Sundays. Some of these expressions also correspond to adverbs of frequency that are mostly used with the present simple. Here is an exercise that you must do at home. It's daily routine. Someone explains or shows what he does during the day. You have some minutes to look at the expressions or activities and fill in the gaps of the correct verb form in the simple present tense. And then, as a homework assignment, you have to write about yourself. What do you do every day? Can you write a short article about your daily routine? See you next time. Thank you very much.